Sister Amanda, <laughs> you are very lucky. God did not only give you a rich husband, but also a good man. <laughs> Sister, I've never seen a husband as caring as your husband. It's all right, dear. I thank God for everything. I asked him for a rich man, and he gave me both a rich man and a good man. Hey, Star, <laughs> I'm happy for you. I pray that God will give me that kind of husband. He will do the same for you. Oh, oh. oh, oh honey. Oh, honey. <laughs> How was it? Oh boy, we love you. Mm. You know, <laughs> I'm home now. <laughs> I miss you so much. I miss you too. Um, Rita. Sir, welcome, sir. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Mm. Sweetheart, uh -huh. a surprise for you. A surprise? Come on. How come? Happy birthday, dear. This is for you. Father and mother for me, yeah? Okay, I will. And when you go back to school, please read very hard. Okay, uncle. Take your studies seriously. <laughs> I will. Thank oh. you, sir. All right. <laughs> This is 250,000 Naira. My husband said I should give it to you. Hey, sister, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Take 50,000 Naira for your school fees, then give the remaining 200,000 Naira to Mama to equip her shop. All right, thank you. Thank you, sister. Thank you very much. And all this are for Mama. Hey. Hey, sister. Hey. In fact, sister, 
I don't know how to express my gratitude. Please tell Uncle that I'm very grateful. Sister, <laughs> this is beautiful. Thank you. I'm that I want to hear stories. Watch! Micah? Um, Amanda, let's go. It's just a little scratch. No, honey. He must pay for this. Amanda, let's go. Amanda, calm down. Calm down, okay? Called me on phone four days ago and told me what happened. But I couldn't come immediately because of my work. It was a serious matter. Help? Is that so? I never knew I could survive it. Help? The family of the dead girl wanted to take the case up. Even when the police wanted to intervene, they bluntly refused. It was prayer, so thank God that. At the end of the day, they accepted to settle with me. I thank God, too. I thank God. It cost me two million naira to close that. Is that so? Help. It was a horrible moment in my life. Had it been that Amanda did not chase that KK man, this wouldn't have happened. Yeah, it's true. But let bygone be bygone. I thank God you survived it, too. Joy! Joy! Yes, brother. Um, please, prepare something for our sister to eat, since your auntie is not around. Okay, don't worry. Jesus Christ, what's the meaning of this? Why should they return you from work? We were eight in number. The company wants to reduce the number of its workers. God forbid. Mr. Chikese, your papers are okay. Thank you. But like I told you before, there is no more vacancy in our company for now. Um, please, Mr. K. I just lost my job some weeks ago. 
and since then I've been idle. Is there no way you can help me? There is nothing I can do for now. But I must be sincere to you. Our company needs good petrochemical engineers like you. But as a growing company, we cannot afford to pay salaries involved. Please bear with us. It's okay. I'm sorry about that. No, it's okay. Thank you for your time. Um, excuse me, Mr. Chikese. Um, would you mind if I ask you to follow me and check some chemicals that were brought in for us two days back? Sure, without pleasure. Okay. This is Mr. Oti, our factory supervisor. And this is Mr. Chikese, he's a petrochemical engineer. Welcome, Mr. Chikese. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, let me take him to check our chemicals. Where did you buy these chemicals from? From our customers. Well, they are all good. But this is better. Okay. You know, this is highly concentrated. And it's from Germany. With this, you can make a thousand liters of paint. But with this, you can only make 500 liters. Oh, that's great. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for your useful information. I appreciate it. This is 5,000 Naira. Please take that for your time. Thank you very much. I'm going to get back to you whenever we need to mix our chemicals. Better still, you help us mix our bands. Sure. Sure. Why not? Alright. Thank you very thank much. Thank you very much. You don't have to up. Your Highness. Did you get the letter I sent you sometime in the past? had already taken the people they wanted to take. The interview was a mere formality. Are you serious? Yes. I'm very hungry. What I need now is food. Okay, let me get you something to eat. Please. Oh. Uh, uh, Peter called about 10 minutes ago. She said that mommy had a successful transplant. Oh, that is good news. Oh, we thank God. Thank God. 
<laughs> oh my god. Look, we'll discuss about this later. That's good news. But get me the food. What exactly are you talking about? I'm tired of running around looking for a job. I've narrated everything to the bank manager and um, he gave me his words. He did for me. I hope you know what you're doing. Mm. It's better you give it a second thought. Don't be afraid. I'm confident this business will favor me. You know, it's just in a matter of a um, few weeks outside of the bank. <laughs> well, you know better than I do. Mm. Baby, mm -hmm. I told you this morning that my mom will be returning from India yes. at the end of the month. Mm -hmm. You didn't say anything about it. What do you want me to say? I heard <laughs> I mean, she's coming to stay here with us and I need to take care of her. There's no problem with that. <laughs> 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 I'm baby. I want you to get a mechanic to fix my car. I don't know how long you're planning to leave it there. This one you want to use it as a collateral. I'm not happy about it. Come on. I told you in a few months all these things will be over, you know, we'll start flourishing again. And you know what? I'm going to get here. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. <laughs> no, <I'm so> <laughs> Excuse me, madam. Yeah. Uh, please, my boss said I should call you. Who is your boss and what business do I have with him? Please, madam, don't keep him waiting. What? Are you stupid? Who are you? I said, who are you? Hello, beautiful lady. Hello. Hi. My name is Prince. Where are you headed? Maybe we can give you a drive. You see, it is not easy to leave a pretty young lady like you under this scorching sun. Please don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, come on. I'm just trying to be sympathetic here. Please. Where are you going? Well, I'm going to Edward Avenue. Oh, nice. We can give you a ride. It's a longer way. Join us, please. Okay? Just that my husband has refused to repair it and every time I'm trekking under the sun some men can be horrible at times it seems he's not taking good care of you did I say that <laughs> please don't quote me okay. sorry 
sorry about that. So, what about lunch with me tomorrow? It's not possible. No, it's not. Thank you. That's fine. Um, drop me there. Oh. Uh, pull over, pull over. Now that my mom is around, I will need some money to go to the market and buy some foodstuffs because we don't have anything here in this house. There's no problem with that. What I'm saying is that we have to be economical with our expenses because of how things are with me now. I can't understand. What are you trying to say? Amanda. You are aware that I have nothing doing at the moment. I'm just saying that we have to manage the little we have. Chikizi, please, 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 please don't annoy me this night. We should manage. Is it because my mom is here? Your problem is that you have refused to adapt to the new condition we found ourselves. Chikizi. Please don't tell me that. If you don't have money, go and borrow. Because my mom will be staying here with us for a few months and I have to take care of her. If it's your elder sister now, you will gather the whole money you have in life and give to her. So do same for my mom. Take it easy. Hmm. I don't know. Thank you. Amanda. That doctor that treated me. Yeah. He was a nice man. Hi. And he was so fond of your sister, Rita. Hmm. You don't mean it. He said he would marry her. That she's beautiful. Every little thing. Rita, this. 
retardat, retard que moi, monsieur Ogeni. Are you serious? Sister, don't mind Momo. I don't even like that man. We love you, this. We like you so much. Momo. I'm fine. She's fine. I can see you're enjoying yourself. Ah. What else can I do? Hmm? That to enjoy the rice God that's giving me. Oh, thank God. No. Honey. Yes, dear. These foods are for your mom. Thank you. God will continue to bless you for me. Please let me go. Oh, no. Mom, I'm coming. Go and peel everything. Cut everything and bring it home. I need to recover fast. Who am I going to be? Easy. Hmm. 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 house without meat. But there is no meat in the pot. That soup your mother was eating when I came in, was it from a different pot? <laughs> now I know what is itching you. Well, my mom is here for me to take care of. I hope you understand. Um, by the way, how much did you bring in the money? Left. Amanda. Your brother did it. Come on, drop that thing and get out of here. I said drop that thing and get out of here. Let me see you here. Your useless so-called girl asking for food yesterday. How much did he bring? Enjoy when you don't have you endure. That is the 